Well, there's a shortage of antibody infusion treatments in Texarkana. NBC6's Donald Britton shares more. Medication to treat COVID-19 is running low at the Monoclonal Antibody Infusion Center in Bowie County. Since they opened in September, the center has been working at maximum capacity. Now they can only administer 25 treatments a day. Everything has been trending upward uh, since Christmas. So our numbers are continuing to climb. Our positivity rate is continuing to climb and the request for treatment at the infusion center is continuing to climb. The drugs used in the treatment are provided by the state and federal government. Last week, the state of Texas was allocated about 2,500 treatments, of which 122 were given to the Bowie County Center. And this shortage is not only affecting Bowie County and the state of Texas. We had over 100 people on a waiting list and we got 12 treatments. Chester Barber is a pharmacist at D Queen Health and Wellness Center in Sevier County, Arkansas. He says the center is treating an average of 120 patients per week. Without the treatments, those in need are placed on a waiting list. At the very worst possible time, we've had a, an inability to get the uh, monoclonal treatments that we need right, right during this spike that we're having. Barber says he's reaching out to government officials with the hope of getting more treatments. We're in touch with, uh, with everybody again today to try to get more treatments to help patients this week, but it is such a struggle and uh, we, we just need something done uh, on the monoclonals to be able to, to continue to treat people. Donald Britton, NBC6 News.